Hey everyone, today we're going to be taking a look at the Die Assault Matrix, or Die Dam as most people call it. But before I get into all the nitty gritty about the marker itself, I want to show you the cool case it comes in because, I mean, it's a cool case. As you guys can see, like, that's a pretty neat case. And super hardcore, super durable. You've got your slots for the two magazines it comes with. It's got your slots for your barrel, for your tools, stuff like that. Little divider pocket. And then, as you can see, this kind of like hardcore, super intense foam that's gonna keep your marker all protected. As you can see, it's kind of got slots for everything. There's your hopper adapter in there. Uh, okay, case out of the way. Cool case dealt with. The marker itself is this bad boy right here. Now, this is essentially a, you know, this is a die matrix. This is a DM, but like in like a woods ball sort of mag fed version so it essentially can do everything that the dm can do plus a couple extra things namely in that it is either hopper fed or magazine fed which is pretty neat so as you can see right there there's a little hopper feed port cover but you can attach the adapter on there and let's just find the mag release now this is actually a dummy mag this does not actually function this has got uh, it's holding like O-rings and Allen keys and stuff. So don't lose this, don't throw it out. This is actually important. As for the magazines itself, let me grab one of these. So it comes with two of these. Uh, they call them 12 round mags. They're more of a six plus six. You got essentially six rounds in one side, six rounds in the other side, and you have to flip it halfway through. And they are compatible with either round ball or shape projectiles like first strikes, which is pretty cool. Uh, they're actually really, they got this really cool design. They have this door thing right here so that while they're loaded, dirt, debris, water, et cetera, is, et cetera, isn't getting into the magazine. So like it keeps your paintballs protected while it's in there. And then once you actually like insert it into the marker, that's what's gonna open the door and then start feeding them. So that's pretty neat. Like I think that's a really cool feature. Switching between hopper and magazine is like crazy, crazy easy. You actually just have this little switch right here and then just that's it. That's all you do. So it is totally possible to be running full hopper of round ball and also rock some mags of first strikes in there and just switch on the fly. So that's pretty neat. Like not a lot of markers can do that. Um, does come with this stock. As you can see, the stock is removable. You don't have to run the stock if you want. It is extendable. As you can see, it's got a little compartment in there for, I don't know, batteries, something, I'm not sure. You do have your on-off ASA right there. So, you know, turn on and off the flow of air to your marker. It is electronic. It is a DM, of, of course. It's got, you know, your semi, burst fire, full auto. It's totally programmable. So you can mess with your rate of fire, stuff like that. So like all that good stuff is in there. And ergonomics wise, it's like super crazy comfortable. Like I cannot stress that enough. Like the grips, like the, the pistol grip is like this really nice soft rubber. It's very, very comfy. This front grip that it comes with that is removable, but like, I don't know why you'd want to remove it. It feels great. It's super comfortable. And the stock, as you guys can see, is like way dropped down. So if you are using some kind of optics and you are, you know, you got a mask on and stuff like that, you can actually like get behind it. It's actually super comfortable, super well designed. So like, I really like that. Uh, a couple other cool little features. Um, does come with a 14 inch two piece barrel. And this whole front handguard thing is actually two pieces. So you can remove the whole thing if you want, if you want to go like a stripped down version, or you can just put half of it on there for like a shorter handguard or whatever. So it's actually like really customizable in like pretty cool way. Um, but yeah, it's basically like, you know, the die dam. You can do everything a DM can do. It can also shoot first strikes. It's also like super customizable, super, super comfortable. Just like, just, you know, really, really, really nice marker. So if maybe you're looking for something that you want to be able to shoot lots of paint, but also shoot first strikes on the fly, if you want to, if you're looking for something like that, I would say die dam. It's also got, you know, comfort on your side and a really nice case, as I mentioned before. But uh, yeah, what do you guys think of the dam? If, uh, if you like it, if you don't like it, what's your favorite thing about it? Leave those in the comments below. If you could give us a like and a subscribe, we always appreciate that. And thanks for watching.